Hi, Jacob from the Light Bridge. Welcome to our Light Lab. Today we're going to have a closer look at... Now we're cooking with light. The serialized cine reflectors are a precise range of reflectors ranging from a real mirror all the way to super wide. And in between these steps, all these different reflectors are going to give you a different range of diffusion. But let's have a look at this with one laser beam because that way you can really find out how precisely they are engineered. A laser beam representing one single beam of sunlight. We're going to use this laser beam to reflect it off the cine reflectors to have a really precise look at how good these reflectors are actually engineered and manufactured. Okay, what we have here now is a Diffusion Zero gray with the laser and the result here on the wall. Diffusion Zero is like a real mirror. This is our laser beam. So basically what you put into Diffusion Zero gray is going to come back out again. There's one thing to point out, this horizontal line going all the way through. You will never see this when using a light source. But for us, we use this to test the quality and the consistency of the reflective surface. So if it is a beautiful streak of light going through, we know that the quality of the reflector is really good. Okay, let's move on. Diffusion 1, color code black. You see the powers of the light source still here in the center. It's a hot spot, so it's really great for redirecting light. Plus, you're getting a little bit of a level of diffusion the way the light is spreading out. Diffusion 2, color code blue. You see how the spread is opening up on us? This is actually one of the first reflectors and surfaces that was engineered for the CRLS. Let's dive into this with the lights out. You really see a big spread of diffusion, but it's still staying in the center, so it still gives you a feeling of a punchy light source. Plus, we see the feathering of the light going out to the side. That's really giving you the quality of the reflector, and you're really going to see this in the shadows. Diffusion 3, violet. You see how the spread is opening up on this? you got this small amount of hot spot here in the center, but basically Diffusion 3 is all about the spread. You see how beautifully it's going all over the walls already? This is really a great level of diffusion that you can add in when you're adding some fill light into a room. It's just going to work perfectly. Diffusion 4 is super wide. The spread is already so insane from the diffusion, it's going from one side of the room all the way to the other one. And if you're wondering, with such a high level of diffusion, why the shadow is so hard? Well, that's something to look forward to in the next video.